Hey guys, welcome back to Unboxing Treasures. I am Jay, and today we have some more pickups from CGC. Results of our submissions for 9.8 pre-screen. Um, just taking a look at this box, these are mostly Wonder Woman. We have a few other books, but this was from Wonder Woman 750. There were a lot of um, stores that had variants for Wonder Woman 750, so we picked up some from various shops. You'll see as we go. The thing that's exciting about this one is, as I was saying in my last video, it's kind of the square binding, so it's easier to get a higher grade. So nine eights are more, more prevalent, and also nine nines and ten point oh's. So, I'm gonna get started with these. Our first one is, all right, one of my favorite artists, Unknown Comics Edition. This is Jay Anacleto. If you have, if you're familiar with him, he does some really, really fine pencil work. He's definitely one of my favorite artists, for sure. So we got the trade dress. Happy to get that graded in that condition. But again, I was kind of expecting it because it is a square bound. All right, our next one. Oh, okay. The Virgin. Unknown Comics from Anacleto and a 9.8. All right. And it looks like we have another, oh, no, my mistake. So this is Adam Hughes. This is the Virgin cover for 101750. Again, you'll see a common theme. A lot of these artists are going to be repeated just because they're some of my favorites. Adam Hughes, Campbell, Anacleto. You won't be, it won't be the last that you hear those names as we go through here. All right. So the next one we have, okay, this is another Anacleto that we hit, the trade dress, the 9-8. Very nice. And all right, we got another Adam Hughes. One Roman, 9-8, it's the trade dress. All right, so this will be the first one from this artist. This is gonna be J. Scott Campbell. He did several different covers, not just not just one. This is his um, variant cover C from his online shop, jscottcampbell.com. So we hit this in a 9-8, very cool. Right, and our next one, this is, okay, this is from Art Germ. This is one of his Wonder Woman 750s. He did a few different kinds, a few different type of covers. Very cool, all right. And just as I was mentioning Art Germ, our next one is one of those different covers. This is the Golden Age edition. This came back in a 9.8. All right. Very cool. I know these Wonder Womans came out a little while ago, but I just received my submission back. I just submitted them and received them back not too long ago. All right, and this is another one of our Anacletos. This one's the Virgin. Very nice. All right, next one. Okay, this is going to be uh, J. Scott Campbell cover A. All right. Oh, ho, ho, ho. just saw the just saw the next one coming out. All right, guys. Very very cool. We hit a nine nine. Wonder Woman 750, J. Scott Campbell, cover C. So, can't do much better than that. You can only get a 10.0, and I can't tell the difference between a 9.9 and a 10.0, to be honest. Maybe if somebody told me exactly what the, whatever small defect it was, but I have no idea. All right, next one we have. All right, we have another Adam Hughes, Wonder Woman 750. This is the Virgin variant. 
Okay. Next up we have another Adam Hughes. This is the trade dress. Nine eight. Oh, what do we got here? What do we have here? We have cover B Wonder Woman coming in at a nine nine. Very cool. All right. A couple more comics left in this box. Oh, what do you know? Another 9-9 nine nine for the Campbell Cover B. Very cool. Love his artwork. Love his artwork. All right. And our last Wonder Woman. This is another Cover A from J. Scott Campbell. Number 750 and 9-8. All right, so these last three comics that we have to show you are not Wonder Woman. This is from Action Lab. This is from the Zombie Tramp series. Well, this is the foil edition. So I don't know how strongly that's going to come out, but... So this comic, when they come out regularly, they do six they do six different covers by three different artists. They have a regular version that's not foil, kind of like this, and then they have a risque edition, which is basically the same cover with the clothes off. All right, so let me see. Next one we have is Issue 57, this is a lenticular cover. You can see that change in hair color. All right, very cool. And the last one we have is the risque cover for this lenticular. So, you gotta cover up the, the goods there, but you can see that. All right, guys. That is our second box out of three that we have back from CGC. Our next video, we'll finish up the current returns that we got from CGC. Hope you enjoyed the content. Hope you're liking the little difference in uh, material that we're showing you. If you do, please hit the like button. Hit the notification bell if you'd like to see other videos with similar content and please hit the subscribe button. We'd love to have more people to interact with and share a conversation about toys and comics and vinyl, if you're into that. But that's all for today's video. Have a good day.